Happy day, friends. It is seven days before I'm supposed to get my period. Um, this was the first, the first official month that Austin and I were trying to get pregnant. And I'm just not sure. I've been having, I don't know, like not weird symptoms, but also not 100% normal. And I know we've been going through a lot with moving and Micah going to the ER and just a lot of things have happened recently. So I don't know if stress has been playing an issue in that, but I'm gonna take a test. I know it's early still, but I guess the sooner that I know, the better um, if I am pregnant. And Austin is out of the house right now. I'm, I'm here with the girls, so I know he's not gonna like walk in on me or anything while I'm taking this test, because ultimately I would like to surprise him again. That's always been fun in the past. But um, I don't know, I'm, I'm really kind of hoping I'm pregnant, but I, I do think that it might still be too early to tell right now, but we'll see. All right, here goes. I'll let that, I'm not gonna look at it this time. Normally I like eyes peeled on it, watching it the entire time, but I'm gonna just kind of let it do its thing because I'm nervous and normally I'm not nervous, but this time I am. Last night was brutal. Paige had a fever yesterday and last night, it, I think it peaked. She woke up crying real bad. She was not feeling good, that poor thing. So I was up with her for two hours last night. I'm feeling a little tired myself this morning. Um, I just got a peek. Just got a little sneak peek. And it's kind of what I expected. I knew it would be too early to really know. So maybe it is, maybe it's just too early to test, but there's definitely no double line there. Ah! Which is like, I knew I should have just waited to test. I just wanted I just wanted to know. I knew it would be too early though. <gasps> Maybe I don't know. Maybe I'll just wait a week instead of trying to test every day and stressing about it and worrying about it. If I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant. If I'm not, I'm not. Maybe I'll just wait a week and test again then when I know I should be getting an accurate reading. Rather than having to wonder like I do all the time. <laughs> do you hear that? They're currently cutting holes in our walls because there's a leak somewhere in the pipes. And so our friend Tanner is here helping us fix it. Let me show you guys. This is not what we wanted to do before we're getting ready to sell this house. Our ladies, poor walls. ladies, he's not single. Don't get your hopes up. <laughs> <laughs> What's inside? That's the You're question. Get copyrighted now that I said that from What's <laughs> Inside's channel, but you know them. Um, I yeah, I watch the channel sometimes. He doesn't post that much anymore. This feels kind of like it's in something. Did we for real poke a nail into a pipe? That's been there for years. It's been there for That's years. What Austin was saying. So I don't know. I mean, maybe eventually it just kind of <laughs> yeah made its way loose. The thing is. Scared that it's, it's gonna leak a little bit, but I guess the water's off. Here, let me get some towels. Actually, <laughs> oh, drain the lines. Drain it. Smart guy. Smart guy. It's like he's done this before. <laughs> so we originally cut here because there's a faucet right on the outside of the house, right here. You can see it, but it's dry. Like it's dry, but as soon as you start reaching up, it's uh, it's wet up in here. So I think I just want to know why there's a pipe right there. Well, to come down to feed the faucet. Uh oh. I heard some kind of watery sound. Uh oh. Come out. There it is. Oh Are my god. Are you effing kidding me? For hey, real? Consider it an achievement. The achievement unlocked! Or that, you gotta show them what was on there. Did you already show them? Yeah. That's the part. <laughs> this, this was what was yeah, hold, it's holding right, it all. Right in there. Oh my gosh. I nice. can hear it. Honestly, though, that's easy. Like, we could have found way oh, worse things to deal with. <laughs> <laughs> that's been in there for years. Yeah, I know. And just now, we started having issues with it. There's some uh, mushroom growing yeah, from under the baseboards. What a time. We're going to have to find another spot for this guy to be. Yeah. On a new pipe at the beginning. I legit don't know how that's been there for years. Without and any never issues. never had any issues. I don't know. 
But that also makes me think, like, what are we going to do with this when we finally move? I don't know. That has we, to Maybe stay. we need to ask him if it was... That has to stay. So I'm this little backstory. Austin and Cam did a men try magic. And the guy, he told us that he's done this trick a few times. It was so cool. And the two houses that he did it to that removed the card, one of them burned down. And the other one, something wild happened. So we've left it up there for the time being, but now that we're moving, I don't know. No, I think we need to. There. <laughs> we will leave that for the they next can, time. They can take it down after if they want. I'm not doing it. <laughs> what you got there? Stair banister, not banister. Ballister. Ballister. I always say the wrong <laughs> one. Stair baluster samples, which I, like, I don't know why I expected them to be, like, all finished in black, but it literally is just. The like shape? metal rods, yeah. Oh, gosh. Um, because, obviously, they get finished after they're made. So, what we're thinking of doing with the stairs, let me fill you guys in. Um, we are going to keep the wooden rails and also the wooden posts. So, we're going to keep some of, like, the the feel of this the house. The nostalgia of the yeah, house. Yeah, within the stairs. But we do want to update it a little bit. We originally thought that we would keep these and paint them white. Um, although, we are staining these like a deep brown kind of to match which is funny you know, because we know the owners cur the current owners of the house and the current owner also wanted to do what yeah, we're doing uh -huh. she was going to do that too and never got around to it so we are going to keep those and stain them and we originally were going to keep these and paint them however just with how thick these are up top we thought you know we're going to update the balusters hi hi how are you you want a cracker? Oh, of course you want a cracker. <laughs> no, don't take my cracker. Just take a bite. <laughs> go ahead, bite. There you go. Say thank you, Dad. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> so we decided that we are going to replace these, or at least get a quote for it. Um, and so we got some samples. You want? Oh, careful. Socks are real slippery. Maybe you should take those socks off. You just hurt your lip the other day, so maybe you, you don't want to slip again. Mama, I'm Boobery Crackers. You're going to have to ask Daddy then. Take care for Boobery Crackers. You guys are freaking ravens. No, no, no. Just you did the it. same thing. Just bite it. <laughs> there. <laughs> you turkeys thinking you can just have mine? So now all we have to do is figure out what size we want. Here's the three-quarter. This is the three-quarter. This is kind of what we are thinking but I I don't know like is the one inch a more appropriate size I, I just can't tell I think the three-quarter definitely looks best this one that's half right no, the other one's three-quarter this is three-quarter this is oh. a full inch that's what I'm thinking too oh yeah I'm I feel like inch. the inch looks better and then we've also got uh, this is a half Inch. I think that's too small. Yeah, that's way too small. Is it though? Is it really? Oh yeah. You guys need to seriously help us because we have uh, we've been having issues trying to figure out everything. Now that I have them all lined up, so we've kind of I, I set them up anyways, but we've kind of just ruled out the circular ones simply because these posts like have such a I guess they have such a squareness to them if that makes sense. But again, if we're not considering something, please, by all means, let us know in the comments. We love hearing your guys' suggestions, recommendations, because oftentimes you will say something or note something that we've never even considered. So please, like, give us your ideas. You really think that's too big? I, I am. I am starting to think that the inch is too big. Like, if you step back, that's a pretty bold. And, and being that there's going to be so many just black bars across, I feel like it will be too much. So... Yeah, you're probably right. I'm honestly trying to decide between this one and this one now. Because even the... I feel like we have to go this size. Really? This size feels like a gate. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like those yeah, gates Yeah, I could iron. see that. I could see that. Yeah, so yeah, this is that actually... Looks, that looks like a three-quarter. This, uh, this is what we're kind of basing it off of. It's a super similar, not a identical, but very similar... Um, look and if these these are just plain it looks like rectangle or squared off bars and they have little feet to them which we will also have so 
that's kind of what we're doing. Yeah, it looks great. Mommy, can I put some treats, please? Oh my <laughs> gosh, you are cute. So if you guys didn't understand, she asked if she could plant some seeds. Please. <laughs> please. Every time we come over here, because there was one time we went out into this garden and we planted watermelon seeds and I have no idea where they are now because I didn't know I should mound them up. Um, so they might grow, they might not. I don't they know where they're growing right now. They might be growing right now. Are those plants or are those veg or are weeds? Those are all weeds. They came back with a vengeance, but they're really easy to pull out, so I'm not worried about it. I'll get some more seeds to plant soon. Is that a good idea? No, I'll water. And water them. When it's all done, this is gonna look fancy. It's gonna look this gonna like. Look this is gonna look. It's like, gonna look like something that we should know. It's gonna look <laughs> too fancy. It's, I'm gonna walk in and be like, I don't know how I'm here, but I'm here. Like I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know how we made it here, but by God, we did. All right, the girls are starting to get antsy. We should wrap it up and head on home. Just to clear up a couple things. Um, so I know that when I was taking that test. I said that Paige was sick. Then we went to the house and looked at the stair stuff and they were sharing crackers. So the that clip of them sharing crackers actually happened a couple days before she was actually sick. I don't know if they got sick from that. I don't think so because Micah was the first one to get sick. But I just wanted to clear that up because it was a little bit confusing. It was out of order. I just thought it made more sense to put the pregnancy test right for, right in the beginning because I know that's why all of you clicked and wanted to watch the video. So I wasn't going to make you wait 10 plus minutes to watch it. So I just wanted to clear that up. Um, and gosh, it's been a few days now and the girls are feeling much better. Austin and I kind of caught whatever they ha had, but it really didn't affect me very much. Austin has a bit of a stuffy nose, but we're all good. Just trying to get by the next couple days so we can get back to like really working on the house. Austin is going to be repairing the stairs in the garage. Um, gosh, what else is happening right now, babe? Balusters. Balusters. So we, d we are going through with the stairs. Um, they are going to replace the balusters. We decided, you know, let's just do it. And that's probably like the biggest thing coming up. Um, I know there's a lot coming up, but immediately coming up, that's the biggest thing. So I'm really excited to see that transformation. But I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. We have something cute coming up. We did the toddler challenge, you know, where like you put treats in front of your toddler and say, okay, don't eat them until mommy and daddy come back. We did that and it lasted a lot longer than we expected. So I'm probably going to release that video maybe even tomorrow. So Stay tuned for that, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, Bye. friends. Love you.